scripture tells us that demonic forces can endow individuals with supernatural strength. In the Gospels, we read about the possessed man in the region of the Gerasenes who could break chains and shackles, Mark 5.3.4. If someone exhibits strength far beyond normal human capabilities, it may be a sign of demonic influence. Always consider such manifestations with a prayerful heart, seeking God's wisdom and discernment. The presence of evil often brings with it an unsettling atmosphere. You might feel a sudden, inexplicable chill when this person is around, a sense of dread that seems to emanate from them. As Ephesians 6.12 reminds us, for we do not wrestle against flesh and blood, but against the rulers, against the authorities, against the cosmic powers over this present darkness. This chill can be a physical manifestation of the spiritual darkness they carry. Demons have access to knowledge that is beyond human understanding. They might reveal hidden truths or future events that come to pass. Deuteronomy 18.10.12 warns against those who practice divination or seek knowledge from familiar spirits. If someone knows intimate details about your life or future that they couldn't possibly know, it may be due to demonic influence. Be wary of this and seek guidance from the Holy Spirit. James 1 24 speaks of a man observing his natural face in a mirror. Mirrors reflect the truth, but demonic influences can distort this truth. If you notice someone's reflection in mirrors or other reflective surfaces appearing warped or different from their actual appearance, it could be a sign of demonic activity. Such distortions are not just optical illusions, but can be manifestations of the spiritual corruption within. Demons recoil at the power of Christ and his symbols. Just as the demons in the Gospels feared Jesus, individuals under demonic influence may react strongly to crosses, Bibles, or other sacred objects. They might avoid these items, show discomfort, or even express anger when in their presence. This aversion is a clear sign, as stated in James 4, 7, Submit yourselves therefore to God. Resist the devil, and he will flee from you. The eyes are often described as the windows to the soul. Matthew 6, 23 teaches us about the significance of a healthy eye versus an evil eye. If someone's eyes appear unnaturally dark, change color, or glow in low light, it could be a sign of demonic possession. This unsettling trait reflects the spiritual battle waging within them, a stark contrast to the light and clarity that come from a life surrendered to Christ. As believers, we must always be on guard against the schemes of the enemy. If you recognize these signs in someone you know, approach the situation with prayer and discernment. Remember our power comes from Jesus Christ, who has already triumphed over all forces of darkness. By staying rooted in his word and relying on the Holy Spirit, we can navigate these spiritual challenges with confidence and faith.